Yeah. You know, if you had waited a few more days before coming down here, it would have been worse. I don't know why it took you this long before coming for treatment. Eh? Oh, sorry, I'm sorry. Take it easy. Take it easy. Sorry. Yeah, I... I just felt it's not something to come to the hospital for. Uh, I thought it was ordinary malaria. And then you see, this is the mistake most people often make. You feel you know what is wrong and you can take care of yourself. And it's wrong. Yeah, I... I, I, I took some drugs that seemed to work, but... That's why I chose not to tell you to come down here. But baby, this morning it was so bad, it was hell. Oh my body, my temperature started again and it was unbearable. You say self-medication is another thing that could be very dangerous. Busy treating malaria when it's typhoid you're dealing with. Do you know I'm shocked now you said typhoid can kill. Ah, even ordinary malaria can kill if not properly taken care of. No illness should be taken for granted though. Medical attention should be sought for when you notice any unusual feeling. But don't worry, you'll be fine, okay? As long as I'm here, you'll be fine, all right? Thank you very much, my love. It's okay. It's okay, yeah. I have to go back to work, okay? How have to go to work? Come on. Oh, do 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 baba wa Oh, do 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 baba wa Ah, I got in your son, one bell at him, my lady. Be mock, boy. Where's the city? Sit there inside with your cafe. This. What are you doing there? And sit there, keep a um, uh, injection and uh, medicine. And I want to ask them for the do. Ah, why is it taking her forever to administer drugs and injection? Madam, what have you been doing? I'm telling to a patient. Why is it taking you forever to administer drugs and injection to a patient? Is it because the patient is your boyfriend? You have been attending to only him since morning. You push you don't turn this place to a love desk. And how is it your problem if you choose to turn into a love garden? Because you're meant to attend to other patients and I've been doing that for you and you're wasting silly time with your boyfriend there. Happy girl. I know what your problem is. You're simply jealous. Me? Yes, jealous. Mm -hmm. Because Felix is Denzel Washington or what? You're jealous because you don't have a boyfriend. Yes, one. No. So you think I don't have a boyfriend? I don't think so. I know so. Hey! If you see my boyfriend, you will know he's not in the same category. I beg you, shut up, make I hear what? You get boyfriend says, now we never see since all these days. They, they deceive yourself. <laughs> see, you're not get boyfriend too. too. Come on, will you shut up and continue your mopping? What's your business? She has started again. Oh, no, Titi, what happened again? She was just working herself up just because I spent extra little time attending to Felix. And I told her she's simply jealous because she doesn't have a boyfriend. Did you hear that? How can she say that to me? No, Titi, that was too harsh of you. We all know Nurse Abigail doesn't have a boyfriend, but you don't have to abuse her with it. What do you mean you all know I don't have a boyfriend? Do you also think I don't have a boyfriend? It's not what I think, considering the fact that it's been a long while since you said anything about you and a guy being in a relationship. Because my boyfriend doesn't stay in Nigeria. He's in England. Hmm. And my grandmother is a virgin. I'm not lying. I just don't like flaunting my boyfriend. That's why I don't discuss him with you guys. <clears throat> hi, Titi. Ah, ah, hola, hi. Hi, Mrs. Hi. So, um, how is Felix doing? Yeah, he's getting better. Not quite long I left him. You know, when he told me he was admitted here, I knew he would get the best of care. Can I see him? Yeah, sure. Yes, go straight. First one on your right, probably will too. Right. All right. Mm -hmm. He's cute. Yes, he's very cute. He's Felix's best friend. And he's a big bobo. Oh, and he's a major player in forex trading. In fact, he's, he's rich. Sounds good. <laughs> yes. And funny enough, he doesn't even have a girlfriend, though. Not have a girl. Mm -hmm. Didn't you hear me? I said he doesn't have a girlfriend. And where am I supposed to hear that? <laughs> you might just need the information, you know. No, I don't. I am not searching. Just because I said he's cute doesn't mean I want to be his girlfriend. I have my boyfriend. Lying to be in a relationship that you're not. We'll be chasing away willing suitors. Stop deceiving yourself. You're not getting any younger. I'm not 
what is the meaning of all this advice? I said I am not searching. You guys should let me be. I beg. Sorry. <laughs> <laughs> oh boy, that was. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I know. Hello, honey. Mm -hmm. How are you feeling? I'm better now, baby. Oh, good to know. Just had to come check on you quickly. Thank uh, you. Caller. Yeah. Please allow him rest. I know, I know. Just give me 20 minutes, okay? Then I'll be done. I have something very important to discuss with him. No, 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 no. 20 minutes is just too much. I'm going to give you just 10 minutes, after which I'll come throw you out. Okay, okay. 10 minutes it is. Hmm? Um, please, what's the name of that nurse that was in the middle of the reception when I came in? Nasabigo. I like her. Please don't. Why? Her boyfriend is in England, and I'm sure she would not want to have anything to do with you. <laughs> oh, come on, baby. Why would you say a thing like that? You never can tell. Hmm? Not as if she's married or something. She can mingle. She's my friend, my colleague, and I know her very well. She's a no-nonsense kind of person. If you don't want to be embarrassed, let her be. Please. Okay. Ten minutes. Ten minutes. Love her boy. Ah, come on, why are you talking like this now? It's Clinic Matters. Clinic Matters. Keep watching. Hey, guess what? <sighs> Felix Frank told me he likes you. Are you serious? Yes. But I had already warned him not to come close to you for anything. You're joking. No, I told him you're a no-nonsense person, so he should not come close to you because you will embarrass him. Why would you say that? Ah, uh -uh. he's my boyfriend's friend, and I don't want you insulting him for any reason, so I had to warn him. Oh, did he? You're a bad friend. Ah, uh -uh. a guy that keeps with good source of income says he likes me, and you told him to stay off. Do you want to die a single lady? Hey, Mr. Lisa, help me out now. Were you not here a few minutes ago when Osabi girl said she wasn't searching? Yes, I was, and that's because her boyfriend is in England. I lied. Okay, I lied. Shouldn't you guys know me better? You guys should know the difference between when I'm lying and when I'm trying to make myself feel good. Oh, I'm so sorry, my dear friend. But that lie of yours has cost you a potential boyfriend and maybe a future husband to be. Titi, I will never forgive you for what you've done. Ah, today, we are now enemies. Ha! See me see trouble. This Osabi girl is a real drama queen. She's so unpredictable like the weather. No, city, you went too far. You shouldn't have at least discouraged that guy from trying to be her friend. Ah, no, sir, why would you say this? You're talking like you don't know Nasabi girl. Ah, I was only trying to save the guy from being insulted, though. You didn't do anything bad. Nancy, now what you do, Nasabi? Nothing. Why? I see for dressing room. See, they look like a person where they offend. Eh? You know, Koku may see attend to percent with that kind of mood. Because if he give a uh, wrong person to percent. Ah, but what could be wrong with her? How can you pretend not to know? I'm sure it's what you told Felix Fenn about her. Ah, ah. Well, why is she angry over that? After she's made it known to her say that she doesn't need a boyfriend. She had already told us she lied. Oh, how am I supposed to know she was lying? After she was saying you thought boldness and authority here. We all heard it. Eh, you see, eh, you go better, make you go bigger. Because the way we see they look, see if you give you that person shop. Oh. No, 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 no. I cannot beg Abigail. Call her soon around. Maybe I would remedy the situation. Okay. Try if you can. Okay. Let me see what I can do. I'll be right back. Let me see what I can do. Eh, if you see the kind way we see they look, eh, ah! eh? you can go back to your post. Eh? Mm. Thank you. Mm. Oh, okay. Don't bother to throw me out, okay? I'm worried on my way out. Uh, no, I wasn't coming to throw you out too. I, I would like to discuss something with you. Yeah, sure. It's about what you said, like you're my colleague. So what about it? Because I've already forgotten about it since you said she's going to embarrass me. Um, I, I was wrong. I shouldn't have said that about her. She's not a bad person, you know. But just like every normal lady who loves to be chased, I would just be a little extreme about it. 
So you're saying it's okay for me to go talk to her and get to know her better, right? Yes, exactly. Uh, please forget about all I told you earlier. Thank you very much, Titi. I really appreciate it. Okay. I will talk to her on my way out. Okay. I'm gonna it. I have an advice for you. Don't approach her the common way. Okay? I don't understand. At the risk of painting her so she's a devil, I must tell you, you know, girl is a drama queen. She loves drama a lot. I've seen her deal with guys before. She can be so unpredictable and very rude. But like every normal lady, she's approachable. Well, that's the kind of girl I love. And I like drama too. <laughs> Trust me, you cannot withstand that girl's kind of drama. But don't just approach her the common way. Simple. <laughs> anyway, thanks for the information, Titi. In fact, she will be the one to find me too much for her to handle. <laughs> All right. All right. Ah, please watch where you're going. Why should I be the one to watch where I'm going when you were the one walking blindly? Excuse me? And you that can see, why can't you pass without pushing me? Or is this corridor not big enough for two? Hey! Did you just hiss at me? Take your foot off my fire. And if I don't? Mr. Man! My name is Kola! I don't care what your name is, just get your foot off my fire. I have work to do! It is obvious you are not taught either in school or at home how to use the word sorry or please. And I wonder what someone like you is doing in such a noble profession where so much courtesy is required. Please. Did, did he just talk to me like that? Ah, no, no, no. Mr. Man! Excuse me, excuse me, excuse me. Me? Yes, you. Can I help you? Maybe you can help yourself. I take exception to people talking to me when you just did in there. How can you say I lack home training when you don't even know me? What are you talking about? You just insulted me in there and I demand an apology. That's what I'm talking about. Me? Insulted you? When? Where? How? Is it that you're pretending not to know or you just don't know when you insult people? Definitely there must be a mistake somewhere. Because the last time we spoke was when I greeted you at the reception before going to meet my friend. Then and after that, we didn't speak. Then you must have the shortest memory in the world. That was an insult. And I demand an apology. Oh, now I should apologize. You've insulted me in the first and refused to apologize. <sighs> okay, I'm sorry for whatever you think I said was wrong. Uh, but I didn't mean to. Better. I'm sorry too. My name is, um... I remember, Kola. My memory is not as short as yours. Ah, come on, I already apologized. So, what's your name? Abigail. Hmm. So, Abigail, can we be friends? Mm. You want to be friends with someone you don't think can say please and sorry? Oh, come on, what's with the insult? I already said I was sorry. All right, I, I, I'm sure I really made you angry. Look, let me make it up to you. Why not just let us go out, you know, have a little chat as friends. Please don't say no. I close by 6 p.m. And if you're not here latest five minutes past six, don't bother coming. Titi was right. She is a drama queen. Mm -hmm. I start. Oh, <laughs> 